So the idea of a dunya is life in which everything you want is close. Your temptations are close. Your appetites are close. Your career is close. Everything you want to hold on close to you. And we want things quickly and we want things within proximity, within reach of us. And when things are far away and they're going to take too long to get to, we don't have the patience for that. Allah says, I'm going to give you akhirah. And we say, when? Allah says, I'll, I'll take care of all that you desire. Yeah, but what about right now though? Because I want to live in the moment. Because you know what, hayat al dunya, it's like super close. What about this moment right now? What's God going to do for me right now? You know? He says, these people, they don't want anything else. They just want worldly life. That's why they're turning away from you. When they look at your deen, when they look at this mission, when they look at this message, when they look at these words, they say, that's not, this, this fits with none of the things that I want. I want to look good. This is not about looking good. I want to feel good. This is not about feeling good. I want to be rich. This is not about feeling rich. I want to show off to people. This is not about showing off to people. I want to, I want, I want, I want, I want. And the Quran is saying, not what you want, what God wants. No, not for you, for God, for Allah. No, then I don't want this. I, I want to live my life. Have you heard this one? I just want to live my life. Allah says, yes, that's what they want. They just want to live this life. Allah quoted them. And they're quoting Allah. They don't even know they're reciting an ayah of the Quran when they say, let me just live my life. Oh, you know Quran. Or no, the Quran knows you. <laughs> Notice also the structure, the exclusive structure of Lam and Illa. Lam Yurid Illa. You could just say, Arad al Hayat al Dunya. These people wanted worldly life. That would mean they want worldly life. They want this lowest life, but they want other things too. They have some spiritual pursuits, some other things. It's interesting. You would think there's materialism and spirituality, right? There's two things, because spirituality is immaterial. Right? Your, your, your Chanel and your Gucci and your Mercedes and your Ferrari, that's material. And your, your yoga meditation is spiritual. Right? What's interesting nowadays is the spiritual is only being sold as something that has material benefits. So the, the spiritual is being turned into the material. <laughs> the only kind of spirituality that sells is you're going to find calm and you're going to be able to concentrate and it's going to get rid of your anxiety, and you're going to feel good about yourself, and blood pressure, it has lots of health benefits. Oh, okay. Dunya, 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 dunya. Yeah, I want to, I like this kind of spirituality. Let me get a yoga mat. You know, that's their musallah, right? <laughs> 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 